Hello everybody and welcome back to Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Randomizer Nuzlocke. So I did some investigating and apparently the next gym leader's top Pokemon level is 16. Mr. Brawly. So we're gonna try to stay with the not using Pokemon of that level. Uh, we didn't actually use Starfire in the last fight. We almost did, but we went with Speakers instead of Starfire to start. So, we're going to try. <laughs> um, if it's impossible, it's impossible. But that might mean I have to avoid some trainers, which is not something I normally do when I play Pokemon. So, Rustboro. Okay, so we've already had our encounter here. But I would like to go for I feel like yellow flute. What does that do? So we're gonna try to avoid the trainers for now. We can always come back to them. Uh, I just tried to scroll with my mouse. Send medicine pocket, right? Snaps them out of confusion mid-fight. Interesting. It's been so long since I've seen or used the flutes. Alright. Okay. Oh, right. We have to teach somebody cut. Uh, okay, let's start with that then. It's probably going to go to... Well... Oh, I might give cut to Staravia just due to stab and I think St Staravia is physical. Yeah. Oh, and I hit the wrong button. I think we'll get rid of... Oh, I hate doing it, but I think Gust. Yeah. We might have to lose Roost in the future, but... Alright. <clears throat> Actually, let's do a quick uh, team recap here. So we have Speakers, who is our happy-go-lucky uh, Goku type. He's doing fine. Uh, did quite well in the last episode. Um, still have our Vegeta Gimli, uh, who also did pretty pretty quick, pretty well. Uh, we leveled Tucker up quite fast, a lot faster than I expected. Uh, Trish, the mom of the group, did great, and Kim and Max tag teamed. So far, the cohesion's really well. I think a lot of people are a little jealous of Starfire for being such a high level. But, oh, Starfire, what is Starfire holding? Oh. Oh, that just means it has cut? It can use cut. Okay. Okay, I was a little confused. But anyway, yeah, team cohesion's pretty good. Can we avoid this? Yes, we can. He moves. What is this? Tunneler's Rest House. Alright, we'll talk to him. He's not going to fight us. Pokemon react badly to loud noises. I think he's talking about um, Loudrids. I feel like a hidden item would be up here. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, is this guy gonna fight us? No. Alright, so we were able to bypass all the trainers here. For better or for worse. 
And was it worth it for a randomized incense? Those are normally expensive, if I recall. And what kind of berries? Chestos. That is the sleeping one. Cool. Yeah, I'm gonna have to come back here and fight a ton of trainers. I just can't with the experience though. Like, if I to do this challenge, that makes it more of a challenge that I'm trying to to do it. Alright. Oh we can catch Pokemon. Oh, what am I to do? We were just out on our walk, Pico and I, when we were attacked by an odd thug. And then the scoundrel made off with my darling Pico. Where are you, Pico? Alright. Um, before we do that... Alright, that's for hidden bases or whatever. Let's get this item. Zap plate. Okay. Pretty sure that just boosts electric moves. For anyone who's not Arceus. Alright, so we can catch Pokemon here. Let's see what we got. Eyes closed. Three, two, one. Oh, a Porygon. Oh. Is that Dupe's Claws? Or sp no, that's Species Claws. How does that work? Because I already have the line. Like, I already have the fully evolved form, right? So I think this is not a... Yeah, that's Species Claws. If that's not in my thing, I'm going to add it now, because Species Clause is always something um, I uh, intended on doing, because I, like, e okay, so for those who are going to be like, oh, but you didn't mention Species Clause before, well, the whole thing is that you want to use different Pokemon and Pokemon that you don't normally use, and also, I don't know if I'll be able to actually evolve Porygon. Um, and, like, I already have its final evolution, so I'm going to go ahead and run, if it lets me. Alright. Okay, I'm going to call Species Claws on that. Really? Okay. Yeah, Species Claws on that. I want to catch something first. <clears throat> Butterfree. Okay, cool. My issue is that we will destroy this Butterfree. Uh, does anybody have a move that would... He's got two, right? But he's going to be weak to bug. Let's give it a shot, though. Alright. Speakers, switch out for Tucker. Oh, Okay. We're okay. We're okay. We're not okay. We're okay. I just risked that thing waking up and using Aeroblast. Why do I keep taking risks? Huh. Alright. Let's throw some Pokeballs. 23. Let's go. Come on, Butterfree. You're asleep! I mean, you don't have damage on you, but you're asleep! Oh, it did. Come on. I need to hurt it. I just don't know who's going to hurt it. 
I think everyone's gonna kill it. Literally everyone. Okay, maybe we'll hit it with Shroomish. It's probably gonna wake up, so we'll put it back to sleep. Ooh! Ah! Okay. It is faster than Shroomish. But we should be able to survive... Was it the Aeroblast? Unless we don't put it to sleep. Okay, we're switching back to speakers. This is too close for me. Uh, what does Trish have? Trish just says like, I'm gonna kill you moves. I mean, Starfire, I don't really wanna get you any le unnecessary levels. Uh, I think they all just have I'm gonna destroy you moves. Alright, so let's go back into speakers. I feel like if I hit it with chip away, it's gonna die. And the move set on this Butterfree is not too bad for the few moves that we have seen. Absorb might not kill. Oh, not even close. Okay. Chip away would probably decimate this thing. Oh, I just don't want to have to do all these absorbs. I think Venoshock's the one that does extra damage if the target's already poisoned. So I don't think it poisons itself. It could. I don't know. I don't use it that often. But I might if I get Butterfree. Once we get in the yellow, I'm going to use a recover. Man, this is slow going though. I think once I get id into yellow, we're uh, going to... Okay, recover time. Speakers! That's its healing. That's <laughs> not. Don't. No. Alright. Okay, we're almost there though. Yellow is going to be my uh, my goal. Level 7 Butterfree. I feel like that's one of those levels you can get in the wild, but more in like a Let's Go Pikachu kind of setting. Because you can get like level 6 or 5 metapods, I think, randomly too. Alright. And the good thing is, if we get this Butterfree, if somebody gets too high on the team, we can just swap them out. Shouldn't have any more air blasts. But I will recover. Because we're cheap like that when you get a TM for recover. 
in a Nuzlocke. Oh, has no moves left. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Premier Ball, go! Join us! No! No! We lost Butterfree! Oh. That is so painful. Okay. What? Are you coming? Come and get some then. The hostage Pokemon turned out to be worthless. Yeah, I'm gonna battle you right here. I'm pissed. Oh, hello. Mega Mewtwo X. Against speakers? <laughs> Alright, he is a fighting type. Oh, we gotta be careful. He's the same level as us. I think we have to switch to Gimli. Oh no! Not happy. Okay, at least we're gonna two shot this thing. Man! Gimli! I thought I was gonna use a psychic or a fighting move. Ugh. Speakers grew two levels. I don't even. We don't even care. We don't even care. Get out of here, Toxic Rogue. You're done. Revenge! I can't believe that! Come on! Yeah, like... <sighs> Mega Mewtwo X. With a four times attack against my dragon. Ah! Come on! Glad to see you're safe. Uh, and you are, so it's Bell. I sincerely thank you. Uh, Cottage by the Sea by Petalburg Woods. Oh, I need to get over that. Oh, I'm so sad. And I don't have Rock Smash. Leave me be. Gun free. Get out of here. Maybe it's a blessing in disguise that we don't have uh, randomized abilities, even though I swear I turned it on. I don't know. Who is it? Porygon. Didn't matter. Didn't even matter. Wait, did it just like download three times? What's going on? Uh. All right, let's return the Devon parts. Oh, hello. He says he can get back to digging, which means I can go in your house. 
Uh, the first the huge crew working there, but we had to stop. So we're lazing around and doing nothing. Alright, cool. Alright, cool. So, I thought I was going to get Rock Smash or something, but... Crap. <laughs> I still have speakers in front! Oh no. You're, not, you're afraid of chip away, huh? Then take it. This is why I didn't use chip away on Butterfree. Sneasel. Same deal. You weakened a normal move? What? What? He's doing a two turn move, right? Whatever, get wrecked. Mew! Okay. It's just the episode to fight all the legendaries. And. We have a problem. Two guys at 17. Alright. That's why I wasn't trying to fight the trainers. Okay. Things are not going well. Don't look down. Okay. Is the guy here? Or do we have to like go back to Devin? Let's heal up. Oh, we have to put Gimli in the grave box. I cannot believe that. That's a Nuzlocke, as I'm learning. I've watched so many Nuzlocke's. And I knew exactly what I wanted for mine and that's such a good team! Dragonite! Uh, Alright. Okay. The sadness begins. Uh, deposit? Oh yeah, I forgot. I gotta use my mouse. That's it? Oh man! That... oh... That hurts. Alright. So we are running into a problem where some of our team are a little too strong. So I think we're gonna have to elect somebody to become too strong. And since these two are past the threshold for the gym, I'm gonna say it's them. Alright, let's go give those Devon parts back. It's not you, is it? No. To Devin! Oh, it's that guy. Oh, you got the Devin parts. You got them back. You really are a great tainer. Here's a great ball. Could use that for Butterfree. Uh-oh. Field trip. Uh, okay. Give me a Pokemon. Ooh, the president. Y'all wait here. He'd like to talk to us. Let's go! Please go ahead. These are all the stones he collects. Steven's dad, right? Mr. Stone. Uh, thank you. You helped us twice. Uh, what do you want? Oh, he's gonna upgrade our Pokenav. Cool. Buzznav. Wow, I can get news. Hooray! You gave me Wi-Fi. Oh, 
deliver this letter to a man named Steven. You should find him in Duford. Cool. Had to go there anyway. You'll have to cross the sea to reach Duford, of course. Ask Mr. Briney, Route 104. Will do. Counting on you. Uh, just come talk to me again. No, we're good. Okay, bye. So I guess we can talk to everyone here at Devon. Wow, they're all... He's so happy I have a poke and half plus. It's not that good. It's like, oh man, you can read the news. Oh, this is way bigger than I expected. <laughs> I'm making a device for talking Pokemon. New kinds of balls. Talk to Kurt. I'm researching fossils. If you have a fossil, bring it to me. Ooh, I wonder if that counts as in the randomized items. If I could get fossils, that'd be awesome. Alright, I think we're at the bottom, right? Hey, you're always welcome here. Well, it wasn't before. Alright. What is this? Hey, Belle. How's your Pokedex? Mine pretty much rules. Alright, yep, Mr. Briny, I guess you wouldn't know since you moved here, but all they say the old guy used to be an amazing sailor. Yeah, I know. I have to go talk to him. Bye! We healed, right? Yeah. Yeah, so like I said, we're gonna do our very darndest to abide by the rules of the challenge. <coughs> where uh, the level challenge but if it becomes impossible I still want to do a Nuzlocke custard berry it's like custard okay I think there's some places we can reach in the forest too as I say that. So, is this the forest that has like a mansion in it? Is that this game? Oh, okay. I thought she was gonna fight me. Miracle Seed. Makes grass type move stronger. Cool. Thank you. Nest ball. All right. Oh that would have been good too! Now we're at the bottom. Oh, we could have had a little up. up. Hey, we didn't see all the options down here. Little pup's cute. Steelix sight. We'll remember that when we have a Steelix. So we have a D-Knight and Steelix Knight. Alright, we're back to 104. Let's go talk to Mr. Briny. Is he inside? Yes, he is. Oh, please. Just don't do this. Oh, if it ain't Bell. That's right. What's that? You want to say with me? What's this about then? Duford. Yeah. I can't believe we lost Dragonite. It still hurts. Okay, how long has this episode been? Eh. Ugh. <laughs> if we can go straight to the gym, maybe we'll catch a Pokemon first, if we can. Hey guys, Future Shadow here, just doing some editing. This episode actually recorded out to about an hour, and I felt that it was a little too long to put onto YouTube, so I'm going to split into two half-hour chunks. So this one's going to end kind of abruptly here, and the next one's kind of just going to kind of continue on from where we were. So I just want to do a little shout-out to Gimli, our Dragonite, 
our uh, Vegeta of the team. I thought honestly thought he was going to be their new leader. So just want to say rest in peace, King. We miss you, and we're going to finish this for you. You and Lolly. We don't want to lose anybody else. All right. Thanks, guys. Have a good one. Peace.